So, Michigan, favored by 9.5. Stats model has got them favored by 0.79. The power rating plus stats has got Michigan by seven and a half up here at the top. Minnesota, it, some of their numbers are a little screwy, even though they have only faced the number one hundred current strength of schedule. Uh, now my numbers are supposed to be opponent adjusted, but I don't know if I can opponent adjust enough to get to that point. So I look at this: the implied score based on the sports book would be. 24 and a half to 15. I would have it 21.84 to 21.05 just basic like just based on stats. I think that Michigan is going to be able to run the ball on Minnesota. Number 32 PPA per rush for Michigan. Minnesota's defense number 77 in PPA per rush allowed. Where I'm highlighting there on the screen. So, uh, rushing success rate Allowed, number 42 for Minnesota. Uh, but Minnesota, number 90 in rushing explosiveness allowed. You saw last week when they changed up the offense that Michigan can be explosive in the running game against USC, and they certainly were. Uh, Minnesota, not good at offensive line yards allowed, not good at stuff rate. I think Michigan found something, and I think that while this line looks a little bit inflated, I think they win this game by double digits. I don't feel good about Minnesota at all. So give me Michigan minus the nine and a half. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and follow me on Twitter at GaryWCE. If you want to toss in a question, you can email me Gary at winningcureseverything.com. Make sure and hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you next time.